Shelby County has a new weapon in the community's battle against drugs. Addicts committing crimes to feed their habits may get out of jail to get help. That help includes a potentially life-saving drug. Rich Van Wyk has the story tonight from Shelbyville. The program is built on a simple premise that drugs equal crime. With fewer drug addicts, many here in Shelby County believe there will be fewer thefts, fewer break-ins, fewer overdoses, and fewer deaths. 90% of our, our crimes overall are tied to drugs. Instead of the courts sending low-level criminals to jail, the Shelby County prosecutor wants them to get help. These are hopefully people we catch early in their addiction and uh, help get them straightened up. People like Roger Gordy, a former factory worker, a father, and a heroin addict charged with drug possession. It's all about chasing the high. It's all about chasing, you know, where am I going to get my next high? You know, how am I going to get the money for it? If Gordy qualifies, the court will sentence him to an intensive program that includes home detention, unannounced searches, counseling, and a drug called Vivitrol. It takes the high out of heroin, oxycodone, and other popular opiate drugs. We're going to remove the entire incentive to use opiates. There's no need to use opiates if you're not getting high from it. Gordy says he's tried and failed numerous times to quit drugs on his own. Vivitrol, he believes, could be nothing less than a lifesaver. It, it sounds like you just want your life back. I really do. I really do. I'm, you know, I'm 32 years old and, you know, I have three kids and, you know, they don't deserve this for me. They deserve to have the best that I can offer them. And, and with me being an addict the way that I am, it, it, it's not going to work. The program is starting small, just five offenders. It may grow only to 20 or so people being involved. Many, though, believe that despite the small numbers, this program can have a big impact on people's lives. And 